Okay, so the inspection's over, and I failed, obviously. Um, that was a nightmare. I'm, like, trying so hard not to cry, because that woman, she was just angry, and had no time to explain anything to me. All the inspectors that came before were very polite, and they explained things to me. This woman was just very aggressive. Like, she came in and the first thing she said is, is there anything that needs to be fixed? And I said, I don't know, because that's, that's her job. I don't know what needs to be fixed and what doesn't. And she said, well, if you don't know, I don't know. If you don't know, I don't know. If you don't know, I don't know. But it's her job to find out what works and what doesn't. And so she's yelling at me, if you don't know, I don't know. I let her walk through and she asked if the stove worked and I said no and I explained about the gas and we went over that a couple of times because neither of us understands why it was turned off or who was supposed to be paying it. And she's angry and yelling and telling me that I just need to get it back on, just turn it back on, just turn it back on. And I told her multiple times that they're, they're supposed to come tomorrow. She said, good, then turn it back on. And like, just, just angry, just very aggressive. And when she was finished, she, she left and she didn't tell me anything. She didn't say pass or fail or anything. Like the other guy, he used to say, okay, you failed for this, this, and this. She didn't do that. She just walked out and I said, um, what happens now? And she said, I don't know. And I was like, well, do I get another, um, inspection or like, she says, you'll get a letter in two weeks. And then she's down the hall and gone. And like, I've never had an inspection that was that aggressive. And it, I, I, I want to say it's just because it's raining and it's cold and she's having a bad day, but I'm a nervous wreck from that inspection. I am just, I'm trembling from the moment she stepped in and started screaming at me that if I didn't know what was broken, she didn't know, I was on the verge of tears. I don't know what's broken, like, and I don't know how to fix things if they are broken. They've never done that to me before. They've never come and aggressively demanded that I be able to fix the things or that I know what, what is supposed to be. It's never, they've always been, they've always been understanding before that their job was to come in and inspect and find out what the problem was because the tenant will lie. So if you're going to come in and ask the tenant what the problem is you're, and, and not even look, and just go off of the tenant. The tenant lies because they don't want to get failed. So they're not supposed to work that way. And I had an inspector tell me that. Like, <laughs> because I failed for the heat not working multiple times. And I told him, I don't use the heat. I don't need the heater. And he told me, I can't go by what you say. I have to inspect the unit and write down what I find. I need to calm down, obviously. <laughs> this was very bad.